Have you guys tried this? I heard a little bit about it. I don't know y'all. Mm, the freshness of it is what made me want it. another vlog this is another hygiene vlog i know it's been forever and ever and ever since we have done hygiene but we are back on it because your girl needs some new shampoo conditioner i need some body wash and just all that little stuff you know that we need as ladies so come with me as we go to Target and see what we can find <laughs> Okay, y'all, we here, and I'm so surprised to see that there is an Ulta Beauty at this Target. Like, I've never seen that ever before. Oh, here are some products I've been hearing about. I've been hearing a lot about this product, and this is for medium hair. What does that mean, medium hair? Need a glow. This is the shampoo nourishes coconut. Ooh, I don't know if I could do coconut. Dang, this is $30 for this little bitty bottle. And all the hair on my head, I don't know. I don't know about that. And then they got this thick hair. And that's $38. This stuff must be good. I need to read some reviews. Like, do we really want to take a chance on this? Because I don't know. I did see something about this to curl gel. This isn't necessarily like the natural hair, like black products, but it still might be good. Let's see. Let's see. Come on, they're like everything, a part of their line is like $30, $38, 28 It better be good. Y'all let me know down in the comments is if that name brand, what is that? It's, I don't even know how you say it. Oa, O, O U A I, I don't know. But let me know if it's some good, because if it's some good, then maybe that's what we'll try next time. But first, before we do anything, y'all know we got to snatch up our Starbucks caramel macchiato with coconut milk and extra caramel. Thank you. You're very welcome.
Okay, so we're gonna start with the hair products. Okay, so let's see these hair products. I am looking for a new detangler that will detangle my hair easily. I normally use Crema Nature. I don't even know if they sell that here. I think I've been on the same bottle. As I always tell y'all, Shea Moisture has the best hair mask. This is one right here, Jamaican. I haven't tried the Jamaican black castor oil um, mask, but I've tried about two or three of them and they work perfectly. So I wonder, this one's probably really, really good too. All of their masks are good for the natural curly heads. But I'm looking for a detangler and I guess they don't sell a detangler. <laughs> I don't see anything. All of this I've tried before. And this is the natural, yeah, this is the natural girl side. Has anybody tried this Taraji P. Henson um, shampoo or line period? Because I have not. And I have not checked any reviews on it either. So I'm not sure if it's any good. Mixed Chicks I know is good. Definitely this stuff, the deep conditioner, is definitely good for sure, for sure. The problem is that they do not give you enough. So that's my issue. But I'm wondering, I need a detangler and that does detangle. Actually, it says nourish, detangle, and hydrate thirsty locks. And it really does do that. I just don't want to get this little bitty. My hair will eat this. Literally. So, I want to, I want shampoo and conditioner. Mm. This is a good detangler too, but this is more of a, a leave-in detangler. That's pretty good. The shampoo, I didn't really care for the shampoo. Love the detangler though. But that's not what I want. <laughs> not what I want. They don't have nothing new for you girl. Why well, look like at this Target look like they got a limited edition. Oh here got my girl. My products are usually good. I don't see a detangler though. She got the rosemary mint strengthening shampoo. I'm trying to think is this what I got it? I don't have the shampoo. I might try her shampoo, but it's not a detangler. We need a detangler, y'all. Unless I do, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. And I know you guys have seen this in a lot of my vlogs, but this is the one that I swear by, the Manuka Honey and Mafura Oil um, hair mask. It is so, it's so good, like for sure. And I see that they even have the samples over here, but you gonna be mad if you get the sample because it's really good. It makes your hair feel like butter. Oh, the sample's only $2.99 and the condition, the mask is $12.59. That's not bad though. A little bit goes a long way. Um, power greens shampoo now. Shea Marshall, no, they just coming out with everything. Power greens. Has anybody ever tried that? Oh no. A lot of that stuff be good though, so I wouldn't be surprised if it was good. I never used her stuff. What is it? Rizos Curls. I've never heard of it. Curl finding. They got a Detangler spray. See, I don't want a detangler spray. Mm, I want a detangler spray. Mm, not what I want. Probably should get some more tea tree. Oh, that might be good for my scalp. I got that. I got that. I got everything I'm almost curious about this Taraji P. Henson shampoo 
Hustle and Co. I'm mad at that. A rich co-wash. How does it smell? Let's see. Oh, I'm about to open this stuff. Let's see. I don't even know. I'm trying to over here trying to be bad and don't even know how to open the, the container up to smell it. Let me go for something easy. Hey, how you opening? Okay, I'm gonna do this. We gonna do the twist and set. I'm gonna smell that. Mm, it's okay. Do they have my deodorant? I don't even see my deodorant here, but you know what? It don't even matter because I think I told y'all that it's a, uh, um, I order it on Amazon in a three pack now. And you guys can also check my Amazon store because I have it. My link to the deodorant is in there. So I don't need deodorant. But let's see, what is the body wash? that we will go with today. I don't see anything new. I don't see nothing new for us. Is it just me or does it seem like this Target don't have a lot of stuff? Even though it's so nice and the, the grocery area is looks like a super grocery store, maybe they took away from the, uh, <laughs> the products or something because it just doesn't look like it's as much as the other target but I guess we shall see and this says simple body wash I've been talking about this I think I talked about this in the last hygiene vlog do we want to try it moisture living what it get me is if it smells good but I don't want nothing to make me itch cuz y'all know I can't just put any and everything on my skin this love beauty and planet and eh, never heard of it oh we do need another one of those have you guys tried this I heard a little bit about it but it's the age embrace now, I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but it says the Age Embrace Pre-Cleanse Shower Butter. Like, I don't know what that has to do with, um, you know, aging, <laughs> but they have the Moisture Boost. I like that, that sounds good. Dove usually does well. Is that what we wanna add to the collection? Shea Sugar Scrub. Um, let's see, I have this. I use this. I actually like this. This is an exfoliator for the body. whether to take a chance or not. Oh, they got a body wash. Acne prone skin. So this is good for those of you who have very sensitive skin. Um, I actually use their cleanser for my face and it does well. I don't have any issues. So I'm pretty sure the body wash will probably be good, especially for the sensitive skin people. And they have a smoothing body wash too that softly it says mildly exfoliates so body conditioner mm. I don't know y'all for this to be a live stream so I can talk to you guys and actually find out what to buy because I really don't be knowing what I don't know what to get that's what I get I should have did more research I did a little bit but I didn't really do you know 
I didn't investigate. That's probably what I should have did before I run out to Target. But, oh well, we'll see how it goes. All right, y'all, so you know the drill. We're gonna get back to the crib and then I'm gonna show you guys what exactly I got. See you there. All right, hey, y'all, so I am back at home and I'm gonna show you guys what I ended up getting from Torje's. So, first of all, I had to get some more Jamaican castor oil. Well, actually it's the, what is this? This is the Jamaican black castor oil. And the reason why is because this is good for focus, man. Why is this not focusing? Oh, because focus on me. Ooh, okay. Um, <laughs> Um, this is good for hair like if you want to strengthen and try to thicken your hair so this is what I feel does my hair right so I got that and it was only $4.99 that is the oil that I use um, mainly I don't really I don't like how it feel like when I put it on my hands and try to rub it through my hair because it's very thick so I mainly use the black castor oil throughout my scalp like I make sure I'm all in my scalp with it mainly when I'm wearing my hair pulled back like this because I don't really uh, I don't all my scalp unless it's pulled back okay then I went on and I got this Miel I think that's how she says it Miel I don't know if it's Miel or Miel but it's the Rosemary Mint Strengthening Shampoo that works really really good i'm sorry about the glare on the light i mean i've never used this shampoo i've heard great reviews about it so i can't say it works good but from the reviews i saw it's pretty good but this is to help strengthen your hair and that's what i'm doing i'm kind of building my hair back up um to try to just make it a lot more healthier than what it is now so we will be trying this out and it says that it is infused with biotin and it encourages hair growth. So that sounds good to me. Um, I guess I'll be the judge of it. I will see. And this is a black owned company. This is the lady. What is her name? I don't know if it's Monique, something like that. But I have been following her ever since her business had even like before her business had blown up to where it is today. So I will continue to support her. Uh, I've already tried like her hair oils and stuff and, and some of her conditioners. So now we trying the shampoo and we gonna see. And it's this nice, strong, mm, minty smell. And I like that. It makes me feel like it's doing what it needs to do on my scalp because y'all know I got psoriasis. That's where you get like the sheets of skin in your scalp. I have that and I use uh, Denorex. That's what helps me um, clear my scalp. So I'll be partnering the Denorex with this shampoo and we are gonna see how that turns out. Now, I also, y'all know I'm the girl that's about the hair mask. I also wanted to try her hair mask. So this is the hair mask that goes with the shampoo. And it is for strengthening hair, just like the shampoo. It also has the biotin in it. It also encourages the hair growth. So I'm just gonna work this through my hair and do like a deep conditioner. And I also got this Kinky Curl Not Today Detangler um, because I used to use this some years ago and I remember it being really good on detangling my hair. Now, how I use it, this is it's, it is a leave-in, but let's say I was gonna straighten my hair. Obviously, I'm not gonna leave that in my hair. Wearing my hair like this, I can use it as a leave-in 
but for the most part, I'll um, detangle my hair with it and then I'll comb it out and then I'll rinse it out and comb it out again. But it does make your hair easy to detangle. So we just circling back. I don't know if you guys know, but sometimes when you use certain products and your hair starts to get used to it, the product could just stop working for you. And so I can't remember if that was the case with Not Today. But I do know somewhere I stopped using it, but I do remember that it was good and it did detangle my hair. So we gonna circle back around cause it's been a long time since I've used it. Another item I got and I need to know from you guys if you know anything about it because this is one that I did not research. But this Dove Moisture Boost, I saw this and it says it pre-cleanse, it's a pre-cleanse shower butter so i guess they're wanting you to you put it on first and then you take your shower with your body gel body wash that's what i'm assuming i don't know but it says serum let me see let's see i was about to say i thought it was a fingerprint up in here i was about to be mad y'all was about to see me going off but so this is how it looks. So it's like a butter, but it's something that you put on before you do your wash down. And it smells, it smells so good. Mmm. The freshness of it is what made me want it. And so we're gonna be trying this new Dove Moisture Boost. I, Dove is normally always good, so I'm expecting for it to be good. And then last but not least, I needed to replace my little bath sponge. So I grabbed one of these. And I'm just, I was just talking and I didn't tell you guys how much stuff was. So let me go ahead and read y'all what things cost just so that you know. So the Miel, the Miel um, shampoo, I paid $9.99 for it. So this was actually a good deal because this little, a little bit will go a long way and it was only $10. So I think that's pretty good. I spent $11.99 on the hair mask. Um, Y'all don't need to see the items again. I don't know why I'm doing that. I spent $13.79 on the Kinky Curl Detangler. And I already told you all how much I spent on the uh, the black castor oil. And you know you can find it at the Beauty Supply too. And you know these are just $1.99. So I should have got a couple of them. But why did it look like they were selling out? Like it was like I only had an option of two colors. I should have just got a couple of the same color. But um, that is all we have for today's hygiene vlog and haul. And let me know down in the comments if you've ever used any of these items. If so, let me know how you liked them. And also, I always take recommendations on what to get next time because I feel like I'll be walking in there so clueless. I'll be wanting to try the newer products but I just be a little iffy, and especially when it comes to my face, I never want to use something and then find out it's bad and break out, especially it having more so sensitive skin. So let me know if you have any recommendations for me. And then in the next hygiene vlog, we will try those out too. Thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. I appreciate all the love that you guys have been giving me over here on Dara Cherie TV. And I will see you guys again in another video. Don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.